Hey guys, my name is Totally Gamer Jet, and today I'm going to be telling you how to set up portals with GoLilyPad. So it's similar to my last tutorial, but I was just asked to remake it for the sake of remaking it. So first you got to make your portals. So you could have portals this small, this big, this skinny, doesn't matter. I'm going to do the big ones because it's so much more interesting. So what you do to create a portal is you do slash portal create and the username. So to get the username, you would type slash server. So I already know that I'm going to make the username for my survival is survival. So we right click on the corner block, right click on the other corner block, and then we just right click on the ground facing straight down, and then it will work. See? Now we are in a survival world. Ooh! Crops! Yeah! Crops! Woo! Crappies! Yeah! Okay, sorry about that. Kind of freaked out when I saw those crops. Um, but yeah. So let's tr show you how this works, and let's do it for the Hunger Games server. So if we do slash server, we'll see the list of things, and the username for our survival server is called Survival Games. That's pretty easy. So now, we do slash portal, create survival games. Enter it, it's going to ask us to right-click the top corner, right-click the opposite corner, and then just right-click some block in front. Let's do that one. And then our portal is created. See? Nice and simple. So now, let's go back to the hub. So, now you're probably asking, well, I made a portal by accident. How do I delete my portals? That's really actually easy. All you have to do is portal, delete, and then the username. Because you can only have one portal for each server at a time. So let's delete our survival games portal. So now, a well, little lag. <laughs> Now you see that our survival against portal does not work anymore. So yeah, you could fill these up with waters. Uh, it doesn't really... You can do whatever you want with them. Uh, design it however you want. It's all good. So yeah, nice, small, nice, big. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope this tutorial helped. If you have any problems, comment below. And yeah, tell me if you guys... Also, I was asked if I could make a fan Skype. If you think... If you really want me to fan make a fan Skype, I'll make one, but tell me in the comments if you really think it's worth making, and thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Goodbye.